We're headed to the northern side of the island. Yeah, New Devon. It's home to the founders of Libertad. Chapter 17. For better or worse. Treasure's probably there. Just need to save Sam before they find it. All right, right on. Before we begin, I just wanted to welcome you back and say a big thank you for tuning in and joining me in A Thief's End. In the last video, Elena showed up and rescued us. It was rad. We had a heartfelt moment. And right now, I'm just kind of scoping out, searching for a can of shaving cream with the possibility of having some dinosaur embryos in it. But so far, no luck. All right, Elena. Just like old times, right? Look. All right, we got a big ladder there. Up there. I borrowed it from your shoreline. Friend. Oh, that's so tight. You slid all the way down from there? Yeah, it was the quickest way to get down to you. Now we just gotta figure out another way back up. Man, butt sliding makes its Nate, appearance very often in this slide. game. <laughs> <laughs> I need to try that again. <laughs> Oh, all right. I'll give you a boost, Elena. Yeah. Here. Oh, that's cool. It's got this little lever mechanism. All right, well, undoubtedly, we're going to run into Shoreline yet again. Ooh, let's start some dialogue. So, have you been here long? On the island? A few hours now. Did you see the column? <gasps> I did, from the air. Pretty incredible, right? I didn't get the full tour. I was a little preoccupied with finding you. Right. Yeah, just a bit. Okay, let me pick up this treasure. Oh, yeah. Sweet. A muggle flared vase. We've certainly found a lot of vases. As you can see from my treasure list on the left, vases, bottles, pots. Lot of pottery. Wow, okay. You know how rad that would be to go butt sliding down there? I think just for fun I'm gonna try it and then I'll edit back up to here. <laughs> Geronimo! <laughs> Nate totally got a head injury. And I'm back. My thirst for adventure was satisfied. Ooh, Elena. It's dark and scary over here. All right, is there any more treasure just lurking? Anything just lurking? I don't know if I even want to be here yet, do I? Elena's over here, so I guess it all just kind of, yeah, it just kind of links up. So, did uh, Sully fill you in on the deal with this place? Yep. Henry Avery, 400 million, 12 founders, hundreds of colonists, something like that. Yeah, that just about covers it. Happens on the <laughs> Ooh. Wow. Is that an elevator? Sure looks like it. I swear, Avery recruited the best engineers of his time. He must have used it to move supplies upriver. Yeah, that's a fair bet. Yes, it is. Yeah, there we go. Dig in, Nate, dig in. Yeah, there we go. Sweet. And there's our ride. There's your car. Just need to get up there. Okay, that's not going to be well, too hard. Think? Which way? Well, let's take a look. I'm jumping in the mud pool. <laughs> Woo! Hopefully there's not any crocodiles. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Going to give her a boost. I'm just going to quickly wander around and see if there's anything cool to check out here. There we go. I can boost you up there. Great. Well, <clears throat> Oh, yep. That's going to be a one-way trip. Wait, do you think there's another way up? Uh, yes, indeed, Elena. Yes, indeed. 
I gotta find a place where I can reach. There's a way through over there. See if you can find something I can use. Yep. Is she gonna throw me a box yeah, or something? something? There's always Come this on. convenient crate. Look out. Yep, there it is. Hello, convenient crate with wheels. Thanks. Ooh, right on. Okay, okay. So I guess I have to get onto the bank here. Yeah, come on, little box. We're gonna go for a ride. Right on. I'm a climber. Rock climbing away. This is seriously cool. Yeah. This makes climbing so much more fun when you have this piton. Seriously. Hey, nice jump. Not bad, right? <laughs> She's like, I know I should come on there these adventures this more often. Like Idiot. Come on, I'll meet you around. It's alright, bro. Oh my goodness. No, 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 no. Oh. That was a very close call. Ooh, I wonder if we can make it to that control. building somehow. See if you can get back up here. Yeah. I will, I will. Yeah, that. I mean, right when I spot that treasure, too. Alright, easy does it, Nate. We're too close to have a major accident. Nate, can you find a way out of there? It looks like a dead end. Well, maybe the elevator still works. <gasps> I doubt it. That would be rad. Been exposed to the weather, and who knows if it ever got it. <laughs> got it. This is so tight. I'm gonna go for a ride on a 300-year-old pirate elevator. Going up. Thank you, my lady. Hang on tight. Explore menswear. <laughs> Well, that's okay. Luckily, there's some handholds here for us. I'll just uh, meet you at the top, I guess. Ooh, is there anything fun in this little cave? No, but it looks very cool. Oh. What? Okay. Bam! Here we go. Yeah! Spider monkey. Oh, no way. No! Holy shit. <laughs> nice moves, hon. Nothing to it. <laughs> that was rad. Okay, I'm going to take your ammo. I'm not going to take then, your pistol, though. The car? It'll be easier to spot from higher ground. Right. Good idea. All right, the major f question for me is, how do I get back to where that treasure this was? This whole thing is powered by the water wheel down there. It's quite a feat for a bunch of people. Oh, right here. Yeah. Sweet. Let's check this out. A muggle hinged box. Very cool. Yeah. I couldn't leave that behind. Right, Elena. Well, you should have seen the stuff he built in Scotland. I mean, there was this. Hold up. You went to Scotland? <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, you see, the, the last place Avery was. Uh... Relax. Sully already filled me in. Ah. Right. <laughs> oh, we're getting some exercise at least, right? Yes. Our morning constitutional, Geronimo! I love it when he just does that run and jump and starts flailing his arms. It's always kind of a surprise if he's going to make it or not because there's plenty of times where he doesn't. <gasps> More mercenaries. Look, 
shoreline. They found your car. Technically, it's there. Oh, so really? Let's get it back. Yeah, borrow, steal, and then borrow and steal it again. I really wish I had a sniper rifle. Okay, it looks like the plan is that's going to be very slippery. So we're going to have to butt slide down and then jump into some of that tall grass. Unless I can Nope, nope, nope. Okay, and that way leads to certain death. I'm going to try climbing up here. Elena, this is too dangerous for you, girl. That'd be so rad just to blow this big barrel of explosives and take that guy out, but everyone would be on to me at that point. So I'm guessing that wouldn't be good. Instead, I'll make him go to sleep. Okay. There you go, buddy. There you go. Alright, it seems like by going this way, I can buy... Oh, oh, oh. Hmm? There's two guys right there. Yeah, you want to come on down here, buddy? Maybe take a closer look. Do some investigations. Okay, you stay there, Elena. Yeah. Maybe... Boom! <laughs> that was pretty clean. Over there, movement. I think might be a rabbit. Movement, eh? You guys didn't see anything. What you got? It was a groundhog. No. Oh, totally gonna take this dude's rifle. All right, is there anybody else watching me? There's dudes all over the place. Come here, buddy. Uh, close enough. All right, the Copperhead is that super tactical rifle. I like more traditional, like the one I've got. That thing's pretty rad. Okay, Mr. Red Dot's still up top scoping me out, so I'm gonna have to try and go higher. You think we can just hop in and drive out of here? That's worth a shot. <laughs> it usually works for us. I don't see why it wouldn't this time. That was pretty rad. He landed right on top of that thing. Oh, but their truck's blocking the path up there. Check that out. Well, ultimately, yeah, here we go. Elena, ready. <laughs> Problem is, I don't exactly know where we're supposed to go. I'm just going down. Maybe. Nope, not down. Not down. Maybe over this way? Yeah, here we go. Sweet, we're in the clear. Thank heavens for our off-road vehicle. And I like how we're instantly safe. Sweet, that was a pretty rad getaway. Oh, wow. Okay, pretty sure we lost them. Look at this joint. So here's my question. Why does Ray Fadler want Avery's treasure? It's not like he needs the money. What's the glory? He doesn't want to be known as a guy who only got rich because of his inheritance. Walking away isn't an option. Very true. Well, Rafe is a good match for Shoreline. He needs their muscle and they need his money. They do? They seem pretty well stocked. Shoreline got involved in a couple of civil wars that didn't pan out for them. Nadine inherited her father's mess. She's probably hoping that this will put her back on the map. All right, I'm not entirely sure which path that we need to take. I'm going to guess it's this one because there's this awesome little stone angel. I tried taking another path, but it led to a dead end that was totally like this big giant cliffhanger. I'll show you is that path right there. You just totally just drop off to your death if you go that way. But it looks like we're on the right path here. Wow, check out that elevator. It's massive. Bet you could write a killer article about all this. <laughs> I could. I doubt anybody would believe it. Oh, you could take pictures too. I didn't bring my camera. I kinda wish I did though. <laughs> they never have a camera. What's up with that? 
Oh well. So why do you think Sam didn't come straight to you after Rafe got him out of prison? I think he wanted to gather every clue that Rafe had on Avery before bailing on him. Plus, he needed time to come up with that crazy Alcazar story. I mean, if I just looked it up. Uh, the road continues on the other side. Let's find a way over there. Okay. Four wheel drive, don't fill me now. That is one crazy contraption. It looks big enough to fit the car. Well, here's hoping this one works as well. Well, if it doesn't. Well, do we have a winch? Yes, we do. Excellent. All right, I would guess that normally we would just drive onto the platform, but the elevator is way up there, so. We need to find a way to lower it. Oh, check this out. Okay, there's this big, I don't know, this big wooden brace. We can hook our winch to it. So that means I'll have to drive right over here. Okay, that's doable. Oh, we don't want to go down that way, Nate. Okay, I'm going to bring the beast around and winch up to that post. gonna get a safe distance away and hope that the entire building doesn't collapse on us somehow oh right on it's the lowering well, lever anything stop the water wheel it really help us though all right let's try something else okay the water wheel is oh oh journal entry how do I get that back? Journal entry. Yeah, there we go. Well, that's a problem. Gears aren't connected to the water wheel. You think it's fixable? We need to get up there and see. All right, all right. Well, I'm guessing that this is the way to go to get up there. Oh, okay, hang on. Time to use our trusty winch again. 